You know, it's hard to believe you guys call this a mid-level uh, pontoon because it I think it really f compares favorably to the really uh, upscale brands. I love this new upholstery. What's it called? It's nanotechnology, and what's nice about it, the vinyl actually has the chemical impregnated all the way through it. So as, the, as you clean it and as the pontoon gets older, the mold and mildew and the ultraviolet rays uh, actually stays right in the vinyl, so it's going to look a lot better a lot longer. And it actually has a seven-year vinyl warranty, which is unheard of for the boating industry. Incredible. Is it easy to clean? <clears throat> Very easy to clean. We actually send a kit with it, and in the owner's manual, we actually list if you get blood or, you know, um, a pop or wine and exactly how to clean it so it'll look better longer. Well, I'm glad of that because I accidentally marked it with a ballpoint <laughs> pen. I'm glad you told me it was easy to clean. Otherwise, I would have blamed it on one of my coworkers here. But uh, it's a great setup, and I love the way you guys do these changing stations. They're so easy to operate. It's uh, incredible. And let's take a look at the helm suit we have here. Well, one of the things that we changed this year is we put the Sony stereo, which is what we put on all our uh, very high-end models. It's now standard. It does have the iPod adapter built into it. It is AM, FM, CD, iPod, and then also is available as Sirius as an option to, uh, for all your listening needs. I think that's a great move. I, I think an upscale stereo is exactly what boats like this need to really bring the younger people into it because they like their tunes. I understand J.D. Power mentioned uh, your stereos. Yes, they actually, uh, we've been, had the highest stereo rating for pontoons the last three years running. And even in, in our mid-range boat like this, we put four speakers in it where typically it would come only with two. So you do get a lot better sound out of it. Let's take a look at the front. You've got some great storage up here. One of the advantages we have is we have what's called an easy access hinge, and it actually drops the seat down, so it's a lot easier to get in and out, uh, especially putting uh, items in there. We put ribs on the bottom, so if you put like life jacks ring in there, it actually will keep it above so there's no water getting in there. And uh, built in drain channels down in there. And what's nice is 100 in Premier, everything in our whole furniture is 100% Rotocast, so there's nothing ever going to rot, which has a lifetime warranty on it. Love this curve, but what's it called? This is the Illusions. Uh, it's Rock Illusions. It's nice because it's got a pattern in it. It doesn't show any wear. It's very, very easy to keep clean. And it's a little darker, so it doesn't show any of the stains or dirt. Absolutely. Well, thanks, Dwayne. Appreciate you showing me around. Thank you. We just finished testing the Premier Sunsation LTD 225. Great little cruising pontoon boat. It's powered by Honda's brand new uh, BF60 horsepower engine, which is a really special power plant. It's got the blast system, which advances the spark uh, to near the knock point to get you to the speed that you need as fast as possible. You gotta really jam the throttle quickly to get it though. Uh, it also has the lean burn system, which uh, gives you great mileage by backing off the air fuel mixture when the uh, loads off your engine. So you get the best of both worlds. Lots of power, lots of uh, performance, and uh, great fuel economy as well. This took us to a time to plane of 3.6 seconds, and we got to 20 miles an hour and 9.4, with the top speed of 21 miles an hour, which is perfect for cruising on the St. Croix River here in beautiful Stillwater, uh, Minnesota. So for more information on the Premier Sunsation LTD 225 and other great boats, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones, and we'll see you out on the water.